10 Mysterious Shows Like Twin Peaks Undoubtedly, Twin Peaks has to be one of the biggest milestones in David Lynch's career. In 1991, the filmmaker who gave us Hollywood contemporary classics like Mulholland Drive, created this show, which revolutionized television. This show is praised for its quintessential black humor and surrealistic setting. Initially, it was cancelled after two seasons because of poor ratings, but rose from the ashes after 25 years with a limited series, which more or less, had the same effect as its predecessor. Though it had a limited run, Twin Peaks has influenced innumerable TV shows. Here's the list of TV shows similar to Twin Peaks that are our recommendations. You can watch some of these shows on Netflix, Amazon Prime, and Hulu. Fringe Fringe is an American science fiction television series created by J.J. Abrams, Alex Kurtzman, and Roberto Orci. It premiered on the Fox Network on September 9, 2008, and concluded on January 18, 2013, after five seasons and 100 episodes. The series follows Olivia Dunham, Anna Torv, Peter Bishop, Joshua Jackson, and Walter Bishop, John Noble, all members of the fictional fringe division of the Federal Bureau of Investigation, based in Boston, Massachusetts, under the supervision of Homeland Security. The team uses fringe science and FBI investigative techniques to investigate a series of unexplained, often ghastly occurrences, which are related to mysteries surrounding a parallel universe. The series has been described as a hybrid of fantasy, procedural dramas, and series, influenced by films like Altered States and television shows such as Lost, The X-Files, and The Twilight Zone. The series began as a traditional mystery of the week series and became more serialized in later seasons. Most episodes contain a standalone plot, with several others also exploring the series' overarching mythology. Critical reception was lukewarm at first but became more favorable after the first season, when the series began to explore its mythology, including parallel universes and alternate timelines. The show, along with its cast and crew, was nominated for many major awards. Despite its move to the Friday night death slot and low ratings, the series developed a cult following. It also spawned two six-part comic book series, an alternate reality game, and three novels. Eerie, Indiana. Eerie, Indiana is an American horror science fiction television series that originally aired on NBC from September 15, 1991, to April 12, 1992. The series was created by Jose Rivera and Carl Schaefer, with Joe Dante serving as creative consultant. Yes, a children's television show is similar to Twin Peaks. USA Today states it's Stephen King by the way of The Simpsons. This series appeals to children and adults alike. This show is said to be partly inspired by Twin Peaks. Like Twin Peaks, Eerie, Indiana is bathed in bizarre mysteries and Marshall Teller, along with his friend Simon Holmes, goes on an endless crusade to solve these mysteries. It was forgotten soon after Goosebumps hit the TV screens, but those who grew up watching Eerie, Indiana say that Goosebumps doesn't stand a chance in front of this children's TV show. A total of 19 episodes were produced. The final episode aired for the first time in 1993, when the series was syndicated on the Disney Channel. The show was rerun on the Disney Channel from October 7, 1993 1, to late March 1996. In 1997, the show generated a new fan base when the Fox Kids Network aired the series on Saturday mornings from January to September, gaining something of a cult following despite its short run. The renewed popularity of the series encouraged Fox Kids to produce a spin-off, Eerie, Indiana, The Other Dimension, which lasted only one season in 1998, The X-Files. The X-Files is an American science fiction drama television series created by Chris Carter. The series revolves around Federal Bureau of Investigation, FBI, Special Agents Fox Mulder, David Duchovny, and Dana Scully, Jillian Anderson, who investigate The X-Files, marginalized, unsolved cases involving paranormal phenomena. 
The original television series aired from September 1993 to May 2002 on Fox. The program spanned nine seasons with 202 episodes. A short tenth season consisting of six episodes ran from January to February 2016. Following the rating success of this revival, The X-Files returned for an eleventh season of ten episodes, which ran from January to March 2018. In addition to the television series, two feature films have been released, the 1998 film The X-Files, which took place as part of the TV series continuity, and the standalone film The X-Files, I Want to Believe, released in 2008, six years after the original television run had ended. Dana Scully and Fox Mulder have dominated our television sets for almost a decade. This show is on everybody's to watch list for two reasons. First, it delves into the unknown, UFOs and aliens. Back in the 90s, viewers were drooling over these concepts. Whether you belong to the 90s or not, you have to admit that thinking about these things is interesting. Anyway, the second reason is the number of episodes. A true TV show addict will agree to the principle of the more episodes, the better, but not always. After nine seasons, the show returned in 2016. It won five Golden Globes in total, including Best Actress and Best Actor in 1996, as well as Best Series, Drama Three Times, Supernatural. Supernatural is an American dark fantasy drama television series created by Eric Krippe. It was first broadcast on September 13, 2005, on the WB, and subsequently became part of its successor, the CW's, lineup. Starring Jared Padalecki as Sam Winchester and Jensen Ackles as Dean Winchester, the series follows the two brothers as they hunt demons, ghosts, monsters, and other supernatural beings. The series was produced by Warner Brothers Television in association with Wonderland Sound and Vision. Along with Kripke, executive producers have been McGee, Robert Singer, Phil Scriccia, Sarah Gamble, Jeremy Carver, John Shebon, Ben Edlin, and Adam Glass. Kim Manners, former executive producer and director, died of lung cancer during production of the fourth season. On August 1, 2010, this entry was published. The series was filmed in Vancouver, British Columbia and surrounding areas and was in development for nearly 10 years, as creator Krippy spent several years unsuccessfully pitching it. The pilot was viewed by an estimated 5.69 million viewers, and the ratings of the first four episodes prompted the WB to pick up the series for a full season. Originally, Krippy planned the series for three seasons but later expanded it to five. The fifth season concluded the series' main storyline, and Kripke departed the series as showrunner. The series continued on for ten more seasons with new showrunners, including Sarah Gamble, Jeremy Carver, Robert Singer, and Andrew Dabb. With its eleventh season, Supernatural became the longest-running American live-action fantasy TV series. The series was renewed for a fifteenth and final season, which consisted of twenty episodes and premiered on October 10, 2019. The series concluded on November 19, 2020, with 327 aired episodes, Special Unit 2. Special Unit 2 is an American sci-fi slash comedy television series that aired on UPN for two seasons from April 11, 2001 through February 13, 2002. The series focused upon the exploits of a top-secret Chicago police division known as Special Unit 2 charged with policing the city's large population of mythological beings, known as Lynx. It was filmed in Vancouver, British Columbia. It was cancelled after 19 episodes due to a change in UPN's management. Lynx are the common monsters from folklore and mythology, except vampires, whose existence is specifically identified as preposterous, and are described as being the missing link between apes and humans, although other human-like species have evolved. For instance, gargoyles, who are identified as humanoid descendants of dinosaurs. They live in hiding and or disguise among the human population. On occasions when lynx are seen by humans, they are usually dismissed as hallucinations or optical illusions, except by those who are especially perceptive. 
Special Unit 2 is the top-secret division of the Chicago Police specifically designated to handle link-related cases. Other units of the police department are specifically ordered to stay out of Special Unit 2's way, which provides a great deal of leeway and access for cases. Gravity Falls Gravity Falls is an American mystery comedy animated television series created by Alex Hirsch for Disney Channel and Disney XD. The series premiered on June 15, 2012, and ran until February 15, 2016. The series follows the adventures of Dipper Pines, Jason Ritter, and his twin sister Mabel, Kristen Shaw, who are sent to spend the summer with their great-uncle, or grunkle, Stan, Hirsch, in Gravity Falls, Oregon, a mysterious town full of paranormal incidents and supernatural creatures. The kids help Stan run the mystery shack, the tourist trap that he owns, while also investigating the local mysteries. Gravity Falls received critical acclaim with praise directed at its writing, characters, animation, humor, and multi-generational appeal. Additionally, the series won two Emmy Awards, three Annie Awards, and a BAFTA Children's Award, among various other wins and nominations. Gravity Falls garnered high viewership amongst kids, teenagers, and young adults during its run and was Disney XD's highest rated show in 2015 and early 2016, while also setting several ratings records for the network. The series has attracted a broad and passionate fandom and has been considered to be an influence for many animated shows that followed it, and has also spawned a variety of official merchandise, Stranger Things. Stranger Things is an American science fiction horror drama television series created by the Duffer Brothers, who also serve as showrunners and executive producers. The first season of the series was released on Netflix on July 15, 2016. Its second, third, and fourth seasons followed in October 2017, July 2019, and May and July 2022, respectively. In February 2022, the series was renewed for a fifth and final season. Stranger Things is set in the fictional rural town of Hawkins, Indiana, during the 1980s. The nearby Hawkins National Laboratory ostensibly performs scientific research for the United States Department of Energy but secretly conducts experiments into the paranormal and supernatural, including those that involve human test subjects. Inadvertently, they have created a portal to an alternate dimension, the Upside Down. The influence of the Upside Down starts to affect the unknowing residents of Hawkins in calamitous ways. The first season began in November 1983. Will Byers is abducted by a creature from the Upside Down. His mother, Joyce, the town's police chief, Jim Hopper, and a group of volunteers searched for him. A young psychokinetic girl named Eleven escapes from the laboratory and is found by friends of Will. Eleven befriends and assists them in their efforts to find Will. The second season is set a year later, in October 1984. Will has been rescued, but he begins having premonitions of the fall of Hawkins, caused by a creature in the Upside Down. When it is discovered that Will is still being possessed by an entity from the Upside Down, his friends and family learn that there is a larger threat to their universe, American Gothic. American Gothic is an American horror series created by Sean Cassidy. The show first aired on CBS on September 22, 1995, and was cancelled after a single season on July 11, 1996. The show received positive reviews and has been regarded as a cult classic. The story takes place in the fictional town of Trinity, South Carolina, and revolves around Caleb Temple, Lucas Black, and the town's corrupt sheriff, Lucas Buck, Gary Cole. Though appearing affable and charismatic, Sheriff Buck is a murderous rapist whose power base is backed by apparent supernatural powers, which he generally uses to manipulate people to fulfill their potential and make life-changing choices, usually for evil. Caleb Temple is a normal child whose paternity masks a horrific secret, Lucas Buck is his biological father, having raped his mother in front of Caleb's older sister Merlin, Sarah Paulson. 
The horror of watching her mother being sexually assaulted caused Merlin to become severely emotionally traumatized and withdrawn from the rest of the world, which was made even worse when her mother committed suicide after giving birth to Caleb. During the pilot episode of the series, Sheriff Buck murders Merlin in cold blood and manipulates Caleb's father, Sonny Schroyer, into committing suicide in order to eliminate Caleb's family and claim his biological son for his own. The newly arrived Dr. Crower, Jake Weber, begins to uncover the sheriff's role in the deaths of Merlin and Merlin's father, and with help from Caleb's out-of-town cousin Gail Emery, Paige Turco, struggles to prevent Lucas from corrupting young Caleb. They are aided in part by Merlin's ghost, who personally appears before Caleb throughout the series in order to try to keep him from Buck's corrupt grasp, Black Mirror. Black Mirror is a British anthology television series created by Charlie Brooker. Individual episodes explore a diversity of genres, but most are set in near-future dystopias with science fiction technology, a type of speculative fiction. The series is based on the Twilight Zone and uses technology to comment on contemporary social issues. Most episodes are written by Brooker, with heavy involvement by the executive producer, Annabelle Jones. In total, there are 22 episodes across five series and one special, in addition to the interactive film Black Mirror, Bandersnatch, 2018. The first two series aired on the British network Channel 4 in 2011 and 2013, as did the 2014 special White Christmas. The program then moved to Netflix, where three further series aired in 2016, 2017 and 2019. A sixth series on Netflix has been greenlit and is in active production since July 2022. Two related webisode series were produced by Netflix, and a companion book to the first four series, Inside Black Mirror, was published in 2018. Soundtracks to many episodes have been released as albums. The series has received critical acclaim and is considered by many reviewers to be one of the best television series of the 2010s. With San Junipero, USS Callister and Bandersnatch, the series won the Primetime Emmy Award for Outstanding Television Movie three times consecutively. However, some critics consider the morality of the series obvious or cite declining quality over time. Black Mirror, along with American Horror Story, has been credited with repopularizing the anthology television format, and a number of episodes have been seen by reviewers as prescient, picket fences, Picket Fences is an American family drama television series about the residents of the town of Rome, Wisconsin, created and produced by David E. Kelly. The show initially ran from September 18, 1992, to June 26, 1996, on the CBS television network in the United States. It sometimes struggled to maintain a stable primetime audience and had fluctuating ratings, due in part to its Friday night death slot. In its first season on the air, it placed 80th in the primetime Nielsen ratings, and in its second season it moved to 66. The series follows the lives of the residents of the small town of Rome, Wisconsin, where weird things happen, including cows udders exploding and people turning up dead in freezers. The show dealt with unusual topics for primetime television of the period, such as abortion, incest, homophobia and LGBT adoption, transsexuality, racism, belief in God, medical ethics, polygamy, polyamory, adolescent sexuality, date rape, cryonics, the holocaust, shoe fetishism, masturbation, animal sacrifice, spontaneous human combustion, and constitutional rights. Illustrative of the subject matter is that the regular cast included a judge, two lawyers, and a medical examiner. Priests from the town's Catholic and Episcopal churches appeared frequently, as did lawyer Douglas Wamba's relationships at his local Jewish temple.